You can oh, do it. You wait, can do oh my it. god! Who is going to talk? So we are basically back from lunch and shopping. I will show you guys what I got later today because I'm super excited about the dresses that I got today because they are really, really pretty. But anyways, we kind of want milk tea now. So we're basically just at the boba shop that's right on the first floor of our hotel. It doesn't seem like they have a lot of milk tea, but there's a lot of different types of tea. So I'm actually excited to try this. Okay, not my best angle, but I'm just gonna do whatever I can here. So I got my drink. I did not get any toppings. Ooh, oh my God, this is so refreshing. Okay, so it's about seven and I just got my dinner. I don't really know what this is called in English, but it's gonna pop up on the screen about right here after I figure out what it is. I don't know, I've never had it before, so I'm like excited to try it, but I'm also not that hungry. Come on. Okay, so basically this is dinner. When I get back to the hotel, I'll show you what I bought today at the mall. See you later! Somehow I totally forgot to show you the dresses that I bought today, but good thing my sister took a video clip of me trying on the dresses. It's good. I like this one too. Dragon fruit! Finally! Mm. I'm bored. I actually really want to be inside swimming right now. Dude, honestly, it's the first night here that we can actually be outside because it's not raining. And there's like people barbecuing in the back, and then there's the pool, and then there's Allie. Hi. Yo. Oh my gosh, I didn't bring my camera, but we're basically just chilling outside of the swimming pool because I'm still on my period and I still can't go swimming which is such a bummer because we're leaving in two nights. I basically can't go swimming, I don't think, tomorrow either. Also because we're going to be going to the night market. But the lighting's kind of bad and everything... Ugh, and I just stuck my finger into the camera, but... Yeah, so we're kind of just chilling. This is like a And then all the mouse all away. I think it's one type of thing. Hello. Hello. What's that? Tea. Yeah. Can we put it outside? Are we gonna sit outside? Yeah. Just put it outside. For me, it's always one fork and one spoon. Okay. I'll show you that. Go to the. Make up my breakfast. I want to sit here. Oh my god! I can smell the pool. Oh my gosh! This is day five in the morning, and I'm eating outside for the first time because it's been raining and yesterday I didn't get up early enough for breakfast. So I guess this is how it is. Today we're having an egg, cheese, and bacon. No, egg, cheese, and sausage sandwich. I'm still having yogurt. I don't, oh, this one's plain. I think this one does not, is not vanilla. I usually eat vanilla. And I'm also having an egg. Oh, and my tea. I have to make my tea. This is like the, my Starbucks are normal. <laughs> so we don't actually know what we're doing today. Yep, so I guess it's a surprise for you and a surprise for me, so we'll just figure it out later. You guys, first stop today is Sea to Sky Gondola, and we're debating whether we want to go on the suspension bridge because honestly, I think a couple of us are actually pretty scared, so I don't know if it's worth like going on or not, but we'll find out, but we're definitely going to go on this, I don't know what this is, the gondola thing. Tickets, tickets. Oh, it's kind of expensive. This is a lift ticket, actually. Oh my gosh, okay, the, okay, let me see if I can get, I don't know if you can see, it's like right here. The gondola is actually like extremely tall. It looks like an almost 90 degree thing. It's like a very high elevator. Yeah. 
It's, oh my gosh. This entire time we thought we were gonna be there already, but look at that. It's actually so far up. That was so scary. The bridge is like right there, like right here. I don't think I can do it. I really don't think so. I mean, it's gonna be really fun, but I, I, I don't know. <laughs> Holy, oh my God. I'm so scared. Okay, it's not as long as I thought it would be. I don't know. I don't know if I can make it to the other side. <laughs> I'm guessing you guys want to see me suffer, so I'm gonna go on this bridge. <laughs> oh my god. Here I go. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Oh my god. Oh my god. Stop. <laughs> I'm not. I got myself to go on the bridge and it's moving and I'm moving very slowly. I don't know why I just did this to myself. My eyes are like watering. It's, oh my God, it's moving so bad. It's moving so bad. Okay, I'm gonna get myself to the other side, but I actually have to walk back, so. It's, it, this is gonna be the worst, like, I don't know, other 10 minutes of my life. You can do it, you can do it. <laughs> oh my God, oh my God. I made it and I'm a little lightheaded. Wow. I made it to the other side after like, I don't know, that was actually like maybe three minutes and I am a little lightheaded. And all I could say on the bridge was, oh my God. Like I literally just kept saying, oh my God, oh my God and it was shaking by the time I got to like the lower parts. So if you're afraid of bridges like me, I don't know, just see how afraid you are, but I'm just, I'm doing it for you guys because I think you guys want to watch me do this. I also don't do well going down hills. I guess I like the outdoors, but I also am not suitable for the outdoors. I can't. <laughs> I... <laughs> Worst part already passed by is okay now. One more time. One more time. I'm gonna try not to make any faces or say, oh my, oh, oh my god, it's so shaky. Oh, I can't. Bingo, I don't talk. Why is it slanting on one side? I'm lightheaded. Just a little bit more, and we're back. <laughs> oh my god. I'm done, I'm done. I am done with bridges. At least I got through one of my fear of bridges and I went through the bridge twice. Whoa. Teary both times. How, how do you feel? I feel great, it was fun. You're not scared, right? In the beginning, but not really. Only when people are like, jumping on it no literally they were jumping on it and then i froze on the bridge i can't it's it's too much like so we basically just walked back from the bridge and now we're just in their little cafe area eating snacks and drinking some i ordered the ice matcha latte we're basically just going to be snacking on some chips i guess that's going to be it on this mountain right and then we're basically going to open it after we're done eating we're going to go back down which one's this Sea salt and vinegar. Uh huh. Gosh. I want one of these. They're so cute. Souvenir. Oh my gosh. Okay, this one's actually even cuter, but I don't know. Huh? Mouyenga. I know, me too. I don't know where to put it either. Quick update we basically just went to the mall and shopped some more, so I did not vlog that part, but we unfortunately, well, yeah, had to get a new luggage because our stuff don't fit. And so also because of that, we kind of bought more souvenirs for family and friends. Basically some maple candies. My arm hurts. Golden maple tea. But I also got myself a 
bag that basically has like a very like minimalist design and says Vancouver on the bottom, but that's basically it. We're gonna go out again in like 20 minutes. So I will see you guys in a little bit. I forgot one little thing. We also bought a couple of toys for Bibu as little souvenirs because she's been very sad at home. And I know there's a PetSmart where we are, but you know, I just feel like we need to bring something for her from Canada. Cause I feel really, really bad for like leaving her like that for an entire week. Richmond Night Market. I ordered a stinky tofu. I love stinky tofu. You're also a stinky tofu person, right? Yeah. Ah, stinky tofu! Oh my god. It's not even stinky. So I think this butterbeer is actually alcohol free because it actually says 0.0, .0 on the thing. But it does really taste like beer and it's actually really, really good. Black stinky tofu, which is like a lot stinkier than the one earlier. So I think it'll taste a lot better. Oh my God, look at the inside. This one is so much better, oh my God. Good morning guys. So we have finally reached the final day of this Vancouver trip and we're not leaving until like the night. So we actually still have about a half day to spend. I'm not gonna lie, I don't really know what we're gonna do. We're probably just gonna do more shopping. So I'll see if I can get any clips. Fallelu. They went down to get breakfast, I didn't. Or they went to get, <laughs> what the heck was that? But yeah, so we're gonna see what's gonna happen today. And yeah, take it from there. Final breakfast of day seven, and um, we're basically having dim sum at Crystal Mall right across from our hotel because we have to like go back and check out. So, oh my gosh, I can't believe it's already been a week. This is so cute. Oh my goodness. Wow, it's actually pretty good. So I got a new purse. It's a Gucci and and this is actually like a yam pastry. Oh my god, this is a karaoke machine. Two dollars per song. We're like literally at another mall, but it's a really small mall on the other side of the city that we haven't been to. Yeah, there's not much going on right now, so. So it seems that we're just kind of randomly looking for places to go, and I don't know why this keeps happening every single time we go on a trip. Our last day, like when we we're waiting to go to the airport, it seems like we don't really do anything, but we're also trying not to do like nothing. This place looks like a hybrid of an Asian market and Safeway. Some people don't know what's safe for. Well, no. If you're in the U.S., you will know. <laughs> okay, so I'm at a boba shop that Ali keeps talking about. It's like right behind me, and I think this is going to be the last boba that we're going to be having. But to be honest, we're actually going to like tweak our drink in a way that we usually won't tweak it because we're going to be on a plane later and Ali and I actually honestly get like motion sickness really easily. So we're basically just going to have to go no dairy, no sugar. Oh, pick a stick from a bucket at random. Chow team? Wow, I want to do it. Uh, you say got matcha boba milk? You die long. They you man or you boba? You have some tension, right? I lost so good. Say boy do you. Ah, you know, say boy do go oat milk. Learn boy ling tong. Yep, boy m sub. Yep, boy ye sub. Sorry. Ho picky. You light ice. This is so cute. Okay, I am going to do this thing. I don't know what it's called in English. Since I didn't get to go to the temple, I am gonna do this here. Oh, I'm gonna do this
What's this? Ikea. Is it like this? Titan sub. 50. I got 50. 50. Where? Nadia. Oh. You will find someone very attractive. Be cautious of your decision. <laughs> what does that mean? Oh my god. Okay. This is very funny. Oh my god. This is only average luck. You are not getting anywhere with what you are doing. You need to think outside the box. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. A smile is your passport to the heart of others. A bubble tea would help. What? <laughs> yeah. Ali, what did you get? I got, you will receive the greatest gift of your life. It's so good. What kind of gift, I wonder? Ali has like, out of the four of us, Ali has like the best one. She has like greatest luck. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Hey, that's so smart. Oh my gosh. Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna try. Mom's doing a more normal photo. Oh, Oh, What's that face? <laughs> He's trying to find number 10 back. Out of what? Out of how many are there? Like 100? <laughs> There's 100 sticks in there and he's trying to find that number 10 that he picked. That is a 1% chance. I don't know how long it's going to take him. He's like... One dollar. He found it. I'm going to take a wild guess to where our hotel is. This one right here. So Ali basically found Deer Lake, which is the lake that she says we can see from our hotel. But honestly, I don't know. I think so, right? I see it. I'm pretty sure it is because I wake up every morning and I look this way. And I could see it. Well, it's it's not really like the camera's not really doing this place justice. It's actually like so much prettier in person. I didn't know that we can kayak here, but I think you have to bring your own kayak. Yo, there's paddle boat. Maybe we should have dude, we should have went paddle boating. <laughs> I'm gonna see if I can get closer, but um one of the goose is actually like laying right next to my sister. Oh she's trying to take a picture. Yeah, she's walking so funny. <laughs> Okay, I just came back out from Foodie World for like, I don't know, the seventh time. Probably not seven, but maybe like four or five times. And I basically just bought a bunch of these mints. I'm slightly hungry, so I just bought me a snack. That's basically it. We're gonna go like return the car and stuff. And then we're gonna go hopefully buy something at the duty free at the airport. Okay guys, so we basically just went to the duty free and we bought some more maple syrup, but I'm probably not gonna show it because we have a lot of stuff to lug and I don't think I can actually film any more of this. This trip has been pretty chill and pretty cool overall. So I'm just gonna end the video here. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please drop a like, comment, or subscribe, and I will see you next time. Bye!